every single day uh, I'm now coming across this uh, conundrum. Do I sell or do I buy first? It's, uh, I've done a, a post about this before, but again, it's becoming a prominent topic every single day. Buyers are wanting to see properties without being in a position to buy them, having not sold their own at this moment. It, it's difficult, I, I completely sympathise with everybody in this position at the moment. Um, I would switch it the other way around. If you had a property yourself available, who do you want coming to see your property? People that can make an offer, buy it the next day, so you can find and, and find that dream home or have something lined up that you want to commit to? Or do you want those people that have not sold yet? I would, ha I would hazard a guess that you want the proceedable people. And it's the same for you walking through vendors' doors at the moment. I've done a recent post recently about intent of looking for a property and you might be making informed decisions on what you're looking for but you really need to be out there in this marketplace airing your property or very worst case scenario having your property ready to go photos taken video done marketing ready just ready to press the button yes your property might sell in this market in a few days but it would still take a process to get to that position of being able to list it the photos being taken sent back to the agents by the professionals, etc. So it can be a, a few day process to get that lined up. How about you went to see a property, loved it, the next day or even that night you could speak to myself or, or the agent that you're instructing with all your marketing ready to go and just flick the button. Flick the button to go live. Have the agent speak to the current buyers at the priority list for your property maybe. Maybe a, a discreet way of doing it. It doesn't have to be socially out there, everybody on, on Right Moon Zoo Plus yet. You could be speaking to people about your property, have a maybe have a, a potential buyer lined up who is willing to wait in this moment. Nobody's going to make you homeless. You sell your property on your terms, so don't worry about the conundrum of selling your property or agreeing a sale and not having anywhere to, put, to, to move to as yet. Nobody's going to make you homeless. Your buyer will actually give you the time in this market because there's a, a lack of good properties. They're going to give you the time. The commitment levels are a lot better than they were 18 months, two years ago. Fall through rates a lot, lot lower. The 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 stamp duty incentive has helped that, has helped that that over the last eighteen months. But actually, they find the commitment levels, the intent, the lack of supply for for people has had a, a, a major impact on that already. Keep keep the faith with it. Keep the faith with it. It's massive to believe that yes, your property will sell in a few days, but it might not do. You might not. You might need to give it that extra little bit of time. You might be asking for a price that's not been achieved in that area as yet or you might have buyers lined up straight away and, and ready to go meaning you can make your move you won't know until you give it that chance you've got to have the faith and give it that chance at this moment and then start searching intently for that ne next property if you want some further advice on this give myself a call all the details are below